The Shipley Glen Tramway is a historic funicular situated in the wooded Shipley Glen near the village of Saltaire in West Yorkshire. The lower station of the funicular is some 660 foot walk away from the Saltaire Railway Station and a similar distance from the historic Salts Mill, now occupied by shops and restaurants as well as the David Hockney Gallery. At the bottom there is a small museum which outlines the brief history of the tramway and Bradford's trolley buses. It's time to take a ride, and we shall be going uphill in the blue car first. The tramway has a gauge of 20 inches and runs for a quarter of a mile in length. There are two tracks with a tram car on each line and the maximum gradient is 1 in 7. Open to the public on May the 18th, 1895, it's the oldest funicular in Britain. The tramway was first powered by a suction gas engine, then in 1915 it was powered by oil before being converted to electric operation in 1928. The operator was Sam Wilson, who erected several other amusement park rides on the Glen, which have long since gone. After a short closure, the line reopened in the summer of 1969 and continued to operate until early 1981, when a right-of-way dispute prevented further operations. The tramway was saved by members of the Bradford Trolley Bus Association with the financial assistance of Bradford Council, who also included a lease for the next 125 years. Operation then continued from 1994 under the stewardship of Mick Leake and his family and volunteer supporters until 2001. Today it is under the care of trustees from a limited preservation company and is staffed solely by volunteers in their spare time. The line closed in 2009 for rebuilding work to be carried out in order to bring it up to modern health and safety standards. We now arrive at the top station where there is a small sweet shop and where the cars are driven by an operator. The cars are controlled simultaneously and this is how the operator works on the system. The bottom station is monitored by CCTV cameras and communication between both stations is made by radio. Should the cars exceed the maximum speed limit of 6 miles an hour, an emergency brake application is made automatically. We now head back downhill in the red car. The ticket structure is simple, you can get a single or return ticket and if you get a return ticket you can ride up and down as many times as you want throughout the day. The funicular operates during weekends and bank holidays weather permitting throughout the year. Heavy rain and strong winds are a key factor as to whether or not the line can operate safely and with an incline as steep as 1 in 7 there must be a good level of adhesion. The line reopened again in 2011, 
the two cars that operate on the line today were overhauled with a new chassis, wheels and decks, as well as improvements to their braking systems and the haulage drum. They can also carry wheelchairs for the disabled. Shipley Glen Tramway is a unique gem, so if you happen to be in the area, it's well worth a visit. Further details can be found on their website.